Car Crushers 2 just updated adding 4 remodels 5 new cars and a new value upgrade feature. But before you take a look at that you should enter in code LAVA for 20 free mission points. This remodeled Nissan looks pretty good, although it's not the best remodel this update, I'll give it a 5 out of 10. The next car that was remodeled is the best, just look at how amazing it looks. I don't know if the sound was changed too, but I think it makes me want to give this car a 10 out of 10. This red Silva also looks good, many people were excited for it, to be honest though I don't think it is super cool, I'll rate it a 7 out of 10. Lastly we have this Avanta, which looks very good, I think I might have to give this car a 10 out of 10, just look at the difference. Now, let's take a look at some of the brand new cars, starting with the Dodge 6x6 truck, wow I really like this, this might be the first Dodge truck in the game, I don't know if this is my favorite pickup truck, but it is very close to the top, 8.5 out of 10 for the rare vehicle type and good execution. Next up is the Ford Mustang GTC, which is based on the Ford Mustang GTD, I like this car because of its unique looks and its raw power, I think I will give this car a 9 out of 10, it was very well executed. Our next car is the limited Ferrari 916 GT, which sounds about as light as a Formula 1 car. I think I will give this car a 4 out of 10 because we already have lots of cars similar to it and it sounds annoying. The fourth new car in this update is the Slag Pot Carrier, which is a large transport vehicle that can drop lava on the ground. I'm a little sad that the lava isn't liquid, but still, look how easily it melts this car. I think I'm going to have to give this vehicle a 10 out of 10 for its uniqueness. The last new car of this update is the Koenigsegg 450C, which looks and feels alright, but it's not super unique, I'll give it a 7 out of 10. Now, in order to get this Koenigsegg, you will need to purchase 500 value upgrades, in order to do this, just grind scraps on small cars and purchase value upgrades, it is actually super easy to get. Speaking of value upgrades, you may be asking how do they work, well how they work is when you purchase one, the vehicle gives you more money when you crash it, allowing cars like the industrial bulldozer, to get far more usability. So what do I think about this update? Overall, I'm going to rate it a 9 out of 10 because the value upgrades will allow the game to get bigger, but other than that, the update was kinda meant on its own. If you enjoyed this video, please consider subscribing, until the next, goodbye.